They're in America. No, they're in Australia. It must be an import. Pure import. They finished that. Disappointed, I was. Is it better than like, the other one they did? It might, no I haven't been down there. Yeah. I haven't seen it. So, it's a lovely day. I don't know if it's going to last. Well, I um, I got up this morning and it was quite light, and then I noticed all the clouds were across the trees. Well, there, there is a the forecast for storms tomorrow afternoon. Yes. It looks like there's a change coming because the sky's kind of gone. Clouding in from there. Okay, don't know what you're doing. No, go Just on. sitting in the middle of the road. Another Queensland driver. Yeah, it's, the clouds are moving in from the west. Yep. It's looking like the change is on the way. Good, good. You know we're going away next week. What day? On Monday. Monday, oh. Monday morning we're going. We'll be away for a week. I think it's called. It's Emerald. And I think it's called Lake Maruba or Maraba or something. I'm not sure, but anyway, so it should be nice. It's 20% capacity. Hey, um, that's boring. 20% capacity. It is low. That's very we low. We need some rain. Um, what's wrong with your voice? I don't know. I, I had a bit of a cold. Well, cold. you know, a bit of a cold is an understatement. I had this, um, I call it flu. I reckon it's man flu. Um... Contrary to most women's beliefs, man flu. Man flu. No, there's proven evidence that men have this flu that's almost a, a, a killer, mm. a threatening killer. Oh, I, I was dead, I tell you. I saw you one yeah. day and I wondered what was wrong, but your voice still sounds a bit oh, weird. Oh, it's hanging in, it doesn't let you go. And we did a video mm. last week and you were okay. No, I was okay. Or were last you week. okay or were you Well no, I was probably had it, but it wasn't didn't hit me then. You didn't have headaches or anything at the no, time? No, I was pretty fine last week. Mm. It was good, but but now Man flu. Man flu, mate, man flu. Even even spoke to a doctor the other night and she said that it's not man flu, it's just a cold. She said. Not sympathetic, are they? No, actually, if it's the one I know of, the doctor mm. I know, yeah, no, mm. she won't mm. go to that. So she said it's not even a flu. It's not. It's not even bad. It's just a bit of a cough, and and I thought, yeah, I'd like you to have it. Yeah, easy for you to say. If you, if, if this women is got worse than having a baby. Exactly. If women got man flu, <laughs> they would know what it's about. Ooh, having a baby only lasts what 24 hours. That's it. It's done. But Look, this is like three, four weeks of your life out yeah. the door. You're flat on your back. You can't do anything. Well, you are when you have a baby too. I would yeah, sort of go but, there. Yeah, but that's not an argument. But, flat on your back, but flat different. on your back for what a week? Yeah. Uh, yeah, so anyway, I um, fought it out and um, I'm alive. This this croaky throat will disappear in time. And, um, yeah, should, you'll survive. You're uh, over it now. You're over the worst of it. I think the life-threatening oh, sure. stages are over. Oh, yeah, I'm alive. Yeah. I, I feel hey, um, alive. I'm gonna, I think that's enough of that waffling oh. on. I don't think people want to hear about Probably man not. flu, especially the woman. No, the women. Are there any women watching this? I don't know. I bet they're they not. Or well, they, they might be do. taking notes. I was going to say they should do because mm. they might get a bit of an insight into... Well, what they probably shouldn't hell. watch it. How do we ban the woman from watching this? There might be some controversial femal, female, feminine issues. Yeah. That, mm. Anyway, um, last week we introduced this channel. Yep. We did it with the phone and the Subaru. We did. Oh, Kiwis, Subaru. Subaru. And, uh, yeah. Today we're now set up in the Mustang. Right. And guess what camera I'm using? What's that? 
Have you seen one of those before? No, I haven't. It's actually two years old, that camera. It's old technology by today's technological standards. Right. It's a Sony FDR X3000. Right. It's, it's in it's optical stabilised mode. We're running 1080p today. We don't need to go flat out on the right. quality. I oh, see it says 4K on the side there. It is 4K compatible, ca uh, capable. Mm. Oh. Let's indicate here. It's hard to talk and do that men, two yeah, things yeah, at once. Exactly, no, we, yeah. We can't do that and we, we are quite happy to say we can't do it. Yeah, that stops the women from laughing about it, doesn't it? If we admit to well, these yeah. things. But this camera, hopefully the quality's better today than the mobile phone we used last week on the dash. Yeah. That you set up so kindly for me at the time. Yeah, yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah. yeah. So, um, as well as this though, you've heard about the new GoPro that's come out. It's the, you've heard about it. GoPro sure. 7? Yeah. I have. Right, well, I, I have. got one. I got one within a day or two of it actually hitting the shops. Wow. Because I'm not Do one you know of those. Somebody? No, 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 no. I'm not one of those oh. YouTubers though that um, have them given to me by GoPro for review. Okay. Before so the release date. Yeah, right. No, nah, I couldn't do that. No. Nah. Not there yet. Maybe. But yeah. I'm not really planning. I'm not into reviews. I like looking at reviews to find out about yeah. equipment and work out: Do I really want one of these? Is it going to do what I need it to do? You know what, I've done a review though, I've done a comparison because I have a need to do this for my own purposes between this FDR Sony mm -hmm. X3000 and the GoPro 7. Okay. And we'll just show a little clip now, but if you want to see the rest of it, there's another video. Um, here's the link here and below. Uh, you can go and see the full, there's multiple reviews actually, every time someone says, oh you didn't do it right, you didn't do it this way, you didn't do it that way, I can do it, just ask, ask me nicely and mm. I might even consider yeah, testing wish. that comparison, yeah. um, but this time, we've done it, this, I actually shot it this morning, two cameras on the windscreen facing forward, direct comparison, 1080p, 50 frames a second, both in full optical, no not optical, because the GoPro 7 doesn't have optical, only digital, okay. but full stabilisation mode, they call hyper smooth is what it's mm. called on the GoPro, anyway, that's done, comparison video is coming up soon on this channel, as I said before, um, Good. well, what else can I say? Oh. So, so the, um, so you took it for a, a flight? Yeah, I went flying with a good. friend's daughter yesterday. Okay. She had an absolute blast. She wants to go again. Wow. Um, but yeah, we did some testing with, just to see how it performed during flight uh, in comparison with the FDR. Yep. Uh, I shouldn't call it that. X3000, the Sony, the action cam that everyone knows well and has loved for a couple of years. Mm -hmm. um, I think they've still got both, really, honestly. They've both still got their place. Yeah. Um, as you would now realise, I'm using the Sony now because it just makes life easier when it comes to it comes to plugging in a microphone, it's got optical stabilisation, it does everything I need it to do. I like the form factor for on the windscreen in the car. Mm -hmm. And um, I mean, I'm sure the GoPro 7 would do just as good a job, probably, well, we won't say better. No, but that's good. But they both have their particular... But the GoPro 7, I don't want to go and fork out 100 bucks for an audio adapter so I can plug in my mm -hmm. microphone. Mm -hmm. You know? I've, I've got two video cameras, one has a audio or a microphone input and one doesn't and it's a bit restrictive. It is very restrictive. Mm. The, the thing is, um, oh, well I don't know what the thing is, this is just more convenient for doing it this way and the Hero 7 will be more convenient when it comes to removing vibration from engines and yep. um, things on aircraft when you want to get that pristine smooth mm. buttery mm. kind of video. You know, and it does stabilised 4K, 30 frames a second maximum. Anyway, that's the oh. camera stuff. Oh, and the other thing that we'll be looking at, did I mention that? We'll be to, there's a GoPro, um, what's it called? App, if you like, mm. for your desktop computer. I think you can use it on your iPads and phones too. That will overlay the GPS data. Oh. You know, like the dash yep. information, the altitude, speed, yeah. your track, I don't know, all these different things, mm -hmm. um, to put on your videos and show... So this is just on the 7? No, it's actually started on the 5, I believe. Oh, okay. Yeah, as long as you've got your GPS data turned on. Yeah. Um, 
So that just adds another feature. It's a little bit cumbersome, and I'll be doing a video about that as well in terms of how to use it and how it works. But yeah, so that's another little trick of it, obviously. Yeah, I, I think so. My dash cam does that. I quite like sometimes to be able to track it. Dash cams aren't quite often high quality, though. No, no, it's not good quality, but if you're using the video, it's good enough to, to look at and spot the. I was going to say dickhead, but we can't say dickhead. Spot, no, we can't. Spot, spot the peanut who's doing peanut. the wrong thing. Yeah, well, I've seen a couple this morning. Here's a couple now. I'll, they're on the dash cam. So, have a look at this. And um, this one. And... Uh, what do you think of that? I mean, probably on camera, though, half the time it doesn't really look that dramatic, but when you got people cutting people off and doing the wrong thing, mm -hmm. you just... Oh. When I first uh, got my dash cam, I only had it on for about a week, and I pulled up at an intersection, and in front of me, coming from both directions across in front of me, two cars collided. Bam! Oh, yeah, I saw that. Yeah, and it was good enough to play back and see the the gas vaporised coming out of the airbag as it deflated. Should have had it in slow-mo. Yeah. Hey, um, how long did you have the camera for before that happened? Only about a week. Yeah, well, and yeah. has anything happened since? No. No. <laughs> that's it. Yeah. That's, that's the most exciting what? thing that's how happened. How many years has that been now? <laughs> that's about three years. Uh, yeah. I, I thought, when you it might. happened, I thought, this dash cam thing, this is going to be good. I'm going to get all sorts of footage here. You might need to get out more. Oh, mate, maybe I should just get out and drive around in traffic. We're out now. We are. Not a lot of traffic, though. Well, I hope the dash cam's actually filming right now, because yeah. I had it out yesterday. <laughs> oh, dear. Um, yeah, but maybe we'll see something else today. Can and if we know. do, we'll put it in the video shortly. Mm. Yeah. So where are we going, Kev? Well, I think we're going to Riverheads. I think we need to find a seat somewhere and have a nice little sit down morning tea. Oh, it sounds like a plan. I've got my coffee, you've got your water. I've got my water, I've got some... Of course some... with the man flu you can't drink coffee because it makes you feel sick, it doesn't does. it? It does, I haven't drank coffee for about three days and oh. like, normally I power through coffee. You aren't well, there mm. is something wrong. Oh, yeah. I mean you're it's not a coffee, just... no. You're I'm not a tea drinker normally. But, but I have had average of two to three cups of tea a day for the last three days. I, I said to Robin, I'm sick. Well, that's probably why you're sick. Mm. Or is that a symptom of being sick? Probably. I think uh. I think the coffee just does not taste like coffee. So hey. when your taste buds are affected. That's it. So what do you think about what's going on in politics at the moment? Politics? What's politics? I don't know. I don't follow you know, politics. I don't really either. I wouldn't really be able to expel any kind of... No, it's all rubbish to me. No, I just couldn't give any good information. I just don't follow I think it. I think it's become a bit of a joke. I know Australia's become a bit of a joke. I'll tell and you that's, what. That's just why, why worry about what's happening because... Now, I raised this point in relation to something you said to me yesterday. What was that? Oh, that was yesterday. <laughs> oh, remember, remember, this is too... What is it, grumpy blokes? Do you, do you need me to remind you? You again? might have to remind me. Is this? Uh, We're not talking politics. Oh, that's what you said, actually. That's what I We're said. We're not going to talk politics. We don't want politics to no. spoil a good channel. most of you, channel. if you're interested in politics, there's probably other places. There's others. We can put you onto some good channels well, if you want politics. Yeah, good. I, Hold on. I Oxymoron, some. isn't it? Yeah. Do you know what oxymoron it means? It means that good politics... You can't politics put two words together and it, is not, it's not real. Yeah. It can't be mm. good politics. I yeah. mean, really? No. You can't do yeah. that. Well, so, all right. Well, there might be some other politics around that people can look at, but yeah. most of us don't. We've got better things to do. No, why get concerned about what they're doing? Anyway, that's enough about that. We weren't going to talk about yeah, it. Yeah, all right, done. We don't want to talk about it. I mean, and have if it a comes look. Up, there might be a good reason in the future. It could. But it could but I, yeah, good reason for it. Again, oxymoron. We're good cruising reason. down a nice, nice country oh, road. Oh, moving on, all right. Yeah, how's the weather today? Beautiful. Clouds yes, in front of us, yes, just yes, nice yes. clouds. Oh, we talked about the weather. Okay, um, it's getting boring now. Yeah, don't want to talk. Oh, I wonder if the barges are 
out there today. The barges. Mm. Hey, look, we're not flying yesterday. Mm. I got this epic. I have. Well, we don't use that word on YouTube because it's used o okay. overused. Okay. I, but still, it was epic. Yep. It's not normal that we would see two barges passing each other as you're approaching in an aircraft filming with high quality 4K cameras. Mm. Check this out. Yeah. I'm just going to show you a snippet. This was like unbelievable. The timing was incredible and I just thought I won't be able to get this again if I try. No. Sunny weather, everything was lovely yep, and my plan. pass, my overfly was awesome. Good. Anyway, I hope you enjoyed that little clip, another snippet from, uh, Looks good. from the aircraft. What's happening on bugs? Bugs? Um, I haven't put much up lately. Still a bit wondering how to get it out there. It's a little bit of a concern. Well, not a concern. It's just something I've got to work out. But um, yeah, I'm still loving. I've got a caterpillar at the moment. I call him Colin. 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 Colin the common crow butterfly. So Colin will be a there. butterfly. Call him CCC for sure. And you can see that work? Oh, that'll that, be that will be. Out. That's future, yeah, yeah that's future. future. But I've got a couple ready to go. Um, I've got the life of uh, a cilid. A cilid? It sounds silly, but that's what it is. Um, I've got, I can't remember what the others are exactly, but uh, I've got quite a few ready to go, so I'll have to get them going. So, yeah. We're not living up to our namesake in this channel, Kevin. Grumpy. Yeah. We're not grumpy, but it's too nice today. There's nothing to be grumpy about at the moment. I know. Nobody's crossed okay, us. Okay, think really hard. What's really cranking me up at the moment? Oh, the dogs are barking next to Oh, door. not those but dogs. Again, I, even oh. my wife is shutting me down now. She's saying, you can't do that. Mm. But I'll tell you what. Yeah, you can. I have to work at home and I'm trying to edit videos and work my business and you've got this dog barking going off at everything and anything and it moves Yep. and it's a big dog and it... Pain in the butt. I've been to the authorities, we spent months and months working on this and no one can do anything or wants to do anything. It's really upsetting. Nobody I'm over it. All no my has... friends are sick of me talking about it. Don't have any friends anymore. Oh, as a result, so that's all gone to the dogs, hey? Literally. <laughs> anyway, who's got dog problems? I've heard there's big dog problems in our area. The council are just swamped with issues and arguments, and, and they don't know what to do about it. They can't. Their, Their hands, hands are tied. tied. Bureaucratic it. nonsense again. Oh, politics. Mm. Stay out of the politics. Yeah. But that's the gist of it. Yep. Don't you get can't me. Don't do that. No don't upset the wrong people. Don't make me go on about it. Mm. Now you're getting your grumpy on. Anyway, look, I'm out now. I'm out. I'm away from the dogs barking, and it's That's peaceful. Good. It's driving the Mustang. We are driving the Mustang, and you can nice. hear that rumbly V8 in the background. Mm. Hopefully, you can hear us over the noise. Oh. That's going to be funny. You'll oh, just hear don't... lips moving. <laughs> See, hear lips moving. Hopefully, our lips are moving in synchronization with the V8, bro. <laughs> 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 Look at that cloud out to the uh, west there, yes. it's quite clear to see here. Sorry peeps, you can't see it out there because you're looking the other way, but if I could turn the camera I would, but I don't want to upset the angle. No. But yes, weather is coming. Weekend could be a bit washed out. Yeah. We need it though. So, Look at the dry well, our, our, countryside. Well, our holiday, as I said, the lake's down and, and the shellfish smell on the banks apparently I've been told um, but oh, you the good time. news is that the rain's coming and the rain happens to be coming next week perfect timing. most of the week you should video that because it's a rare event you know it's been 10 years since it rained <laughs> I don't know <laughs> they probably uh, get one decent downfall every two years yeah out back Queensland it's our back, isn't it? Classified? Well, I suppose central. Central. I guess it's central Queensland. Something like that. Does that make us on the coast out front? Yeah. No? Yep, out front. Never really thought about that before. Mm -hmm. Wonder what it is when you get to the border. Outback Australia. 
Where is the Outback Australia? Where does it start? Where does it end? Well, it, it ends out the back. But I don't know where it is starts. Is that Perth? It must be. Is that Western Australia? Is it the back? Well, if you can't go any further. Or is it central? That's the side though. But isn't central Australia central Australia? What's that up on the hill? Is that a car rolled into the paddock? It looks like it's a car. I've seen one of them like that in Maryborough. Mm. I saw a boat like that saw yesterday. That. We saw one the other day. I couldn't really see it. I saw a boat on the rock wall at the marina while I was flying on the edge of the rocks, yeah. sunken. Oh. And apparently I spoke to VMR, the volunteer marine rescue people. Yep. I said, I don't know if you're aware, but there's a boat sunken on the rocks at the marina on the outside wall. And they said, yes, we are aware. Thank you for your concern. Um, we had a rescue uh, last weekend, weekend before last, mm -hmm. um, and it's now an insurance matter. And oh. apparently there were two boats involved and the other boat had people on it. So I got the full gist of it and I've got, here's a photo. I'll just give you a quick shot of it yep. from the aerial yesterday. And uh, yeah, it's quite dramatic really. I wouldn't have wanted to have been on that boat while mm -hmm. this, apparently a squall came through. Oh, okay. um, and it was very windy, and this is why these boats were just. I don't know why there was nobody on this boat. Maybe it was moored somewhere. That's a good mooring point there. Well, it won't go anywhere shallows. now. No, it's moored, yeah. <laughs> more or less. Yeah, more or less. <laughs> yeah. Yes. So there you go. Do you want to um, grab that boat? We'll take it for a test run. Oh, that boat? Yeah. Was it, it was for sale, boat, wasn't boat it? Boat for sale there. Yeah, we could just take it for a test run. Nice little afternoon out in the water. Whoops. Let's go through. Um, mm. Riverheads, Kev. Yes, this is Riverheads. We are going to have our coffee shortly and relax. Sounds like a plan. So, we, I guess, will sign the video off here. And if there's any other dash cam footage while we're heading back into town later, I will put it in here now. Um, Catch you next week, probably. Oh, you're away. Yeah, I'm away. On Monday, or Monday week. Oh, I'm away both. Oh. We leave Monday, and we come back on Monday. All right, so, so probably we'll leave it for a week. So we'll have to... Um, so you'll have to watch this one twice. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah, why don't you... I'll play put it up backwards. I was just going to say that. Thinking. Wow, yeah. yeah. Right. I was going to say, play it backwards, and they can watch it forwards All one right. week. And you might have some subliminal messages in it. You never know. You don't. Red rum. That from? Um, that was out of some Beatles sting apparently. Yeah, it's funny what you can hear though if you listen hard enough. Oh yeah. Yes. I'm not sure. I was, I'd say that the um, songwriters would be laughing a lot about some of the things that's come out. Yeah. I like it actually too when you have um, you go to an art gallery and there's an exhibition and there's probably a talk about it and the people like. What do you call them? The curator might give a story about the art and say the artist intended to do this and this is what they were thinking and da da da. Mm. And the artist's sitting there going, no, no, I wouldn't. No. no, I just thought I'd just slop a bit of paint there for that and dab a bit here. Well, I wouldn't say slop. I think they did think, I thought into it. But I think sometimes the people that analyse these yeah. pictures go in so deep, way beyond what the artist yeah. intended. I, I've noticed that. I've it's probably not always the case. <laughs> But you wonder. Yeah. Yes, this looks lovely. Are you into art out there, anyone? Maybe you've got some high credentials in that area. Mm. Yeah. This is Riverheads. Check it out on the dash cam. Now we're using a Mobius dash cam, just in case you're wondering. It's not really a dash cam, it's a multi purpose camera. Yes, the barge. Yes, the barge is coming. I'm not going to park here. I'm going to go to Fraser Island and the Mustang. Mm. Do you know what Fraser Island is? Let's just pull up here and make a nuisance of ourselves. Fraser Island is sand. I'm just going to drive across you to don't. Fraser Island. How's that? There's the barge coming. This is where I flew over yesterday, Kevin. There was two barges, one oh. going and one coming. That's amazing, isn't it? To think you can sit here and look at this, and yesterday you were looking from... This is where they load the thousand. barge, Kev, and there's a lot of four-wheel drives and stuff go over. Mm, I don't think yeah. they'd appreciate me sitting there. Probably not. The, um... Oh. There's a beautiful little bird, a um, honey bee eater. We won't put that in there. Rainbow bee eater. We won't put it in there. No, I just saw him, I thought it was very nice. Can we park 
Where's the seats? They've taken. Are there seats anywhere? Some there. Oh, we can sit there. Okay, let's park over there. Is there a seat over parking over there? No. No parking there. Car parking no no. We're gonna have a curb? No. There's no car parking. No parking. Yeah. This is uh, no through as well. Yep. I can't go in there. You got a hat, Kev? 